So I have been officially nominated for multiple categories, video creator of the year and streamer of the year. I am up there with some pretty big hitters, you know, some pretty big hitters. Um, but I am asking you to please go and vote for me. All you have to do to vote for me is click on the link. It will be the first link in the description for the next three weeks. Click on, or you have to sign in, vote, click on me and everyone else that you want, uh, but make sure that you don't skip me. And then you click next, you click submit. And if I haven't already voted for myself, then, you know, whatever, but I have. So there you go. That's all you have to do. Thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. And, um, Get into the freaking video, boys! Whoop whoop! Yo, what's going on, sexy Samalanda squad? You know it wouldn't be a try hard Thursday Sam the Dude video if I didn't bring out the the only Masters Border in Duel, bro. The only Masters Border in Duel. It's me, and it's said. What up, gamers? Anyways, I got some big news, man. I got some big news. So, um, <clears throat> maybe I go beads first. Actually, I probably dropped a couple kills because I went, I went uh, shell first, but that's fine. That's fine. If I go beads, I can beads is three, but without it, it's. I mean, it's less kills early, but. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um, anyways. Big news. We hit 2,000 subscribers on Twitch. Which means next Friday. Next Friday. I will be doing a 24-hour live stream. And it potentially could be longer than that. Because every 100 subs after 2,000. I'm going to be adding an extra hour to the stream. So. It could be potentially a pretty long stream. 30 hours plus you know it's gonna be scary it's gonna be it's gonna be sick though so make sure to tune in for that next friday and also tomorrow yes this friday i'll be doing a four hour to five hour stream of exclusively fight club i know how much y'all love that shit i know how much y'all love fight club so don't even flex. Oh, I hit the minions instead of him. Unlucky. Doesn't really matter because it still works for the wave clear, but we're chilling. So yeah, um, tomorrow, Fight Club stream. Make sure to tune in so you can see that. I'll put the... Uh, I'll put the... Link. Or at what you have to type in right here. Boom, right above me. Which Sam the dude. Um, so yeah, all you got to do is go type that in. Follow the channel so you can be notified whenever I do go live. And yeah, other than that, we're like, we're fucking hard chilling, bro. He hits five here. I'm not scared of him, though, because I also hit five here. And I think my initial level five is way better than his initial level five. Um... <clears throat> I see the path before me. Going to a speed buff, I think. It's so upsetting that my with two minions it doesn't clear, dude. Maybe it maybe it should clear. Maybe it shouldn't clear. Maybe it'd be too OP if it cleared. You never know. All right, red buff down for me. Perfect. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, he's right here. Good damage. He has alt and he has bracer, so he probably feels somewhat unkillable at the moment. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you that that is not the case for you, my, my man. That you are more than definitely unkillable. Perfect. I didn't even have to use my shell for the tower shot that I assumed that I would have to. Awesome stuff, dude. Awesome stuff. I'm actually going to clear this wave because I'm super greedy. 
It doesn't have blink or anything, so it's not actually that greedy, right? Assuming I run all the way back here to back, and I don't lazy back my ass off. Alright, he just jumped, so we're safe. He probably takes my blue buff here. To be completely honest, that's what he should do. And I would not be mad about it, because that would be the correct play. I'm gonna go straight to my speed buff. Pick this up. Obviously I have red buff, so I can't pick this up, but... Dropping it is, is what I need. A little bit of XP and gold. Drop that shit. Let's see. He's doing his blue. I probably won't be able to steal it. <coughs> Excuse me, steal it. Oh, never mind. Cancel that. I actually stole it. I I The reason I said I probably wouldn't be able to steal it is because I think he was... Or he should have at least been able to... React to me teleporting over the wall and then stun me, secure his buff, and then just be on his merry way, but I guess maybe I was a little bit too far away to just be reactionary stunned. It was good for me, bad for him. That does 250 damage, that's not fair. Uh, he, do he has more power than me. Actually, he doesn't, actually, because I have 16 stacks already. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ult this. I have shell. And by the way, I still get my healing, even if I'm not doing damage to him. Um, I still get my healing from my ult, just from hitting a target that much, you know? Take tower. That clears wave. We aren't scared about that. Closing in on the five minute mark might be a surrender. I don't know though, late game Kali, man. Never count late game Kali out. He's going transcendence too. I think I'm just gonna go the boots. And I think I actually am gonna go beads for my second relic for sure, because that will guarantee that I don't get stunned out of my ult and he just runs away. Um so I'm guaranteed going beads for second relic. And next item, I could be going either into a breastplate for the cooldown and the defense, obviously. Um or I could go into a soul leader, which is more survivability. Do I want more cooldown and survivability, or do I want more damage and survivability? Is the question. Um, I think I actually want. I th okay, I think if I'm winning this game, and if I'm I'm really trying to just try hard and win the game. I go defense, and then I go soul leader after. Um, by the way, I, I literally couldn't be any less scared of, of this man. Probably a surrender? Not a surrender. Wow, surprising. But yeah, I, I literally could not be any less scared. He does nothing to me. But we are going to sit here and punch this phoenix for the next two minutes. Saved my teleport for his jump so that he wouldn't land on me and heal a lot. Because if he did land on me, he would have healed at least 300 HP and then probably would have been able to just auto trade me and win the fight. So, good game, good game. There's the set, boys. I'll see you in the next one. Yo, what's up, sexy Samoletta squad, bro? I just cut out like 13 minutes of Q. Priority queues are a biznatch. Anyways, I'm finally ready. I'm finally in the game. I'm finally ready to clown. I know a lot of people really like these. Um, hold on. First, let's go. Let's go. Bracer instead of beads first. Um, a lot of people really like these Try Hard Thursday videos because I actually play the S tier gods and. I show off what you can do with them. And I really enjoy that. Like, I know sometimes it can be a little annoying to see the same gods played over and over and over. But if it's only in one video once a week, 
it's not a big deal, and it seems like you guys really enjoy when I do play these tryhard gods, so. I love it, man. I have a lot of fun. Alright, let's see. Do we get the buff? He's gonna show his face. Oh, first blood. Alright. Dr. Fogelson. First blood, dude. I was waiting for him to show his face. Most people do that, you know. Most people, when they get pushed out of their buff, they refuse to accept that they lost their buff. And instead, they'll run back at the buff. Oh, like, 90% of the time end up losing their life and the buff, so... I'll be honest, man. Losing the buff is definitely the better one in this in this scenario. You don't want to just throw your life away for no reason. Oh, I suck. Oh! The power shot. Ouch. All right, nice. Second kill, dude. Second kill. I'm going to go ahead and just ult this wave so I can back. All right. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. I'm going to grab tier two boots and a mana pot. We're pretty hard chilling. I don't, I don't really think there's much of anything left for me in this match, to be honest. It'll be really, really tough for him to uh, make a comeback from this. Especially with the way he's playing, because he plays so aggressive, man. And when you're behind, playing aggressive is definitely your enemy. I'm a whole level and a half ahead of him. I missed. I got the minis, so like I'm not upset about it really, but my god I do so much damage per auto. Alright. Oh my god. Oh dude, he started with tier 2 chronos pendant or something? I just noticed that. That's really... that's really odd. Let's just fast clear this with alt. I don't really care about, um... I don't need my ult to win a fight, basically. Dude, he still doesn't have his item yet. Oh my goodness. How much health he lost. wonder if he jumps over for blue buff. I caught my man window shopping. Dr. Fogelson. You can't just window shop in a duel match anymore. It's 2020. You will always be punished. You will always be punished window shopping. Let's go back. I have a lot of gold, dude. I have actually so much gold. Holy. Not only will I get my whole transcendence, but I will also get my attack speed boots. And one back. Holy guacamole. Talk about a back, man. My goodness. I ain't losing a stack. I'm not I'm not losing a stack to that tower, dude. You good, bro? Um 
I can't tell if this is maybe just abuse at this point. And to be honest, I it kind of feels like it is just abuse. We're five minutes in now, and he hasn't surrendered. Which is surprising to me, but also not that surprising to me. He's still playing. Oh my gosh. There's a madman. <laughs> Dude, I was I was so nervous, so close. Oh my god. 14 HP, dude. 14 HP. Damn. Oh, the pause. Alright. The pause. Oh. Stretch out them shoulders, man. Stretch out them shoulders. Hey. Oh. You voted. Hey. Good shit, my man. He fucking voted for me, bro. That's so gamer. Thank you so much, dude. Dude, I, w I really... I really would love to win the nominations. Like, the, the ones that I'm up for... I'd love to win them. Streamer of the Year is going to be tough, dude. They, they get a lot more viewers than I do. So I feel like, just based on audience size, they would win those. But honestly, who knows? Who knows? A monument to my opulence. All I know is that I'm super cool. And, uh... I'm nominated for two things, and ideally we're gonna win both of them. Actually, no. Not, not ideally. We're gonna win both of them. We are. We are gonna win both of them. And it's not just me. Like, it, it's in my name, yes. But, like, it's literally a People's Choice Award. It, it, it quite literally is a community of people who vote for you decide if you win or lose. So, it's very much so a we. A we thing. Hello, Ixordia. Are you ready? That did a lot of damage. That too it did 450 damage. I think I could kill him in his fountain, actually. Like, genuinely, I think I could kill him in his fountain. You ever just miss off everything? Oh, good Aegis. Good Aegis. So I do so much damage. I just, I just wanted to buy the Aussie real quick. Just wanted to buy the Aussie so I could lifesteal a little bit, you feel me? Oh my... Oh. Archers. Hell yeah, dude. I vault up soon for the minion wave. 
Wait, I do want to try to kill him in tower, actually. A monument to my opulence. Huh. Now. Hey. Nice. GG. <laughs> Thanks so much for voting. You're so awesome. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Let's get into the next one. I'll see you there. Yo, what's up, sexy Samuel and Squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1 again. Again, we got Uller, bro. It's so insane that we actually got Uller. Because I feel like every single game, or not every single game, but almost every single game, Uller's banned. Well, normally I first ban Uller, so I never play him. But, I mean, shit, dude. This, you're in for a treat, man. I haven't played Uller in forever. I mean, I played him yesterday in stream, but I haven't played him in a video in, like, years, I think. Like, act, like legitimate years. Where's Odin? There's Odin. I'm over here, simpy boy. Alright. Blue buff acquired. Easy game, dude. Easy game. All I had to do was sit there, wait. I suck. Holy shell. I have no mana. Ooh. Oh, you're so cool and attractive, dude. Damn. I was going Blackthorn first item. Or Sledge. I don't know if Sledge is good in duel. And I always say that, but I like I never know the answer to whether I would ever pick up Sledge in duel or not. Because it's a good item. Like, it's a very, very good item. But I don't know if it's the best item for duel. You know what I mean? He didn't pick anything up yet. We just keep clearing, man. He lived! I was going for the style points. Oh! I was going for the style points and it backfired on me, dude. It backfired. I don't even think my three would kill him right now. Oh, you better not. Oh, you better not. I missed. You lived again. <laughs> he lived again, dude. There's no way my man's out here living like this. I'm on the edge of my goddamn seat. I, I shelled though, and my sh my shell's on cool. It killed me through my shell. It it killed me through my shell. Killed me through my shell. Killed me through my shell. It killed me through my shell. It. Dude, I'm still like completely dumbfounded that. He lived through all of that. Like, what? How? How? How did he live through all of that? It's so incredibly disgusting. I guess first off, maybe I shouldn't have gone for the style points. Did he go Blackthorn? 
Blackthorn into defense. I don't really have the mana to fight right now. Just gonna stun that shield off so that he doesn't get a big head, you know? Oh, he's dead. You really lived through three of my threes at one HP and then died to archers? You are are you really out here just trying to make me look like an idiot? Because you're doing a damn good job. <laughs> you're doing a damn good job. Mm, I don't want to back yet. I, I'm so close to just affording my finished transcendence, you know? Alright, one more wave. Fill all the outs. Alright, let's go back. He does scare me a little bit. He's really tanky, I'll admit. Right, like... Yeah, he has 1600 health already. And, I, and I'm the one with the, with the lead. And he has more HP than me. That being said... Oh no! That being said... I don't think it matters too much. Because if I need to... Oh, he sold his defense to go boots. I'm not picking that up, by the way. I was going to pick it up originally, and then I was like, nah, I'm on blue buff. I'm having mana issues, alright? I'm having mana issues. That didn't hit me, huh? Dude, I'm missing everything. It's not a big deal because I'm fighting an Odin. But if I wasn't fighting an Odin, I might lose this game. Like if this was an Uller Mirror instead of an Odin match. Like that? Oh, right there. Should have probably would have died. Alright. That's okay. That's okay. Use my abilities so I get my abilities up in the other stance faster so I can clear and back. And I know I know red buffs up, I don't really care. I'm gonna go Soul Eater. And probably blink to be honest, because if I can just blink and barrel stuff and axe, I might be able to kill him easier. Blue buff, thank you. Where's my man's at? Doing the minis right there. Where is he? Where's my man's at? Oh, there he is. Okay, he's not even close. Nice. I'm gonna blink in, barrel stuff, and fight. Never mind, he's just running away. Blink barrel stop. Okay, that I mean that hit him, it made the noise and everything. Dude, 
Dude, imagine being this bad at video games. Like, holy. Nice. That time I went for the style points and it actually worked. It actually worked. Hit this Titan now. Um... God, I do so much damage to this guy. I actually do so much damage to this Odin, man. God, let me out! Let me out! Oh gosh, okay. That time was about to beat my ass, dude! <laughs> that Titan... That Titan was about to slaughter me, holy crap. Alright. GG, gamer. Let's get on to the next. I hope you guys enjoy the Odin... Or, not the Odin game. The Uller game. I don't play him much, but he is fun. See you in the next game. Yo, what up, Sexy Santa Squad? Next up, we got the Nemesis game. The Nemesis. She is kind of OP, so I put her in the uh, I put her in the Try Hard Thursday category. Also, can we just acknowledge the fact that it's Thursday and I'm actually doing a Try Hard Thursday game on Thursday? Can we just like acknowledge that? That's a pretty big deal, man. I'm gonna go blink. And I'm not going to get my three, and instead I'm going to try to just steal this man's blue buff again. Basically, anyone that needs a blue buff a lot, like a mage, um, you should just steal it. It's like the best way to get ahead early game. It's like the most free early game. Did my mans just see me? I think he sees me. I don't care though. Because as long as he doesn't get his red, I'm about it. Or blue, I mean. Alright. I'm cool with this. Damn, he started defense. Why am I dead? My man's just dropping heals and all of a sudden I'm fucking dead, bro. I swear to God. Damn. What hit me, by the way? Was it minions? Did minions turn on? Oh. There's minions. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. So I can't clear the wave. Ever. I mean, once I get Golden Blade, maybe. It really sucks that he saw me invading, because like if he didn't see me invading, I'd be so far ahead right now. But instead he's so far ahead right now. I just dude, I just don't do damage. Like he just drops heal and I can't clear at all. It's the worst. This is the worst thing in the game. I can't kill a fucking archer minion. Alright, we got Golden Blade. So we're gonna get really far behind early game. Let's just let's just be honest. Early game, I'm gonna get so far behind 
that'll more than likely be three levels behind at one point in this game. But it's about trying to, I guess, not let that deficit lose you the game. Really, really annoying matchup, by the way. Early game, it's a really annoying matchup. Late game, I win for free. If I can survive the late game. Going straight up into defense. Wonder if he ults this. He didn't. Alright, I'm down. I mean, letting me farm is his biggest mistake. Because right now, like, everyone knows that I lose this game if he just doesn't let me farm. If he just steals my buffs and shit. But he's letting me farm, man. Big mistake. Big mistake. If I don't get a level deficit... By the way, I don't really care if I lose tower. I should be strong enough by the time I get Phoenix, or by the time, I should be strong enough by the time he's at Phoenix to be able to fight him. Probably dead here. Damn. Oh, he just went tyrannical. He's just gonna push, huh? That's his whole game plan. Make minions super fucking tanky. Not a bad plan, honestly. Because I can't clear. Especially if he's maxing his heal. Damn, just first item tyrannical, maxing his heal, I think. Yeah, how do I stop this? I mean, obviously, I just stop it for free after, but... By the, by the way, the reason I stood in his 3 with... Or, I stood in his heal with my 3 up is because... It would do damage to him, which means minions would target me instead of tower, which means my tower lives longer. Whole reasoning behind that. I think I need to get... Need to get something, man. I gotta figure something out, because right now, probably just Toxic Blade, to be honest. Toxic Blade and then like a Pestilence, maybe? I think I lose tower on this push here. Unless I ult him. Oh, I didn't kill. Alright, Toxic Blade, coming in. Not finished yet. Man, this early game is so rough. I just can't clear, dude. The Tyrannical plus the healing. Not to mention the fact that the heal gives him a... Or not him, but gives the... Whatever's in the heal a protection buff as well. This is a really shitty matchup. I wonder how I'm gonna 
Damn, tyrannical boots into more defense, man. Imagine. I actually can't kill minions. This up? Nope. I, dude, I can't do anything. I actually can't play the game. Holy. You see this? This is fucking terrible. I can't do anything. Oh, he's also slow immune in this too, so I can't even catch him with my ult. I don't think I can. He probably has enough mana for his one. I think the only way I counter that is... I need to get my Toxic Blade, and then after Toxic Blade, I go straight into Atalantis, so that I have 20% pen. And... I probably go Curse Donk as well. No, I can't go Curse Donk. I have to go Curse Donk, fuck. I have to go Curse Donk, but I also need... Survivability. Like, I need a Pestilence and I need an Atalantis Bow. I don't know if I can live long enough to get both of those. Or, quite frankly, even one of them. It's so weird, because, like, the second I get full build, I win this game for fucking free. Because he, he can't run away from me. But, like, right now, I just can't clear a wave. And he's just AFK in wave. With his tyrannical plate helm and his heal. I think I have to fight here, honestly. Your middle phoenix is under attack. Well, I mean, at least we push him off Phoenix, right? It cost me everything. It cost him everything, too, though. That blue buff for me. He's just healing right now. Go get tier 2 Atalantis, and then meet him at my Phoenix. I think I want speed buff. There he is. Sub gamer. Yeah, he did. <laughs> Once I get Atalanta's, I can probably fight him, but I will still need my relics to do so. And then after I get my pestilence, I beat his ass for free. And then after I get my hasty katana, not only do I beat his ass for free, but I take his ass to fucking court for free too. What, like, if he can't run, he fucking loses, right? Uh, I can't even catch him with alt up. Oh, I really thought that would get me. Nope. Try to catch me all you want, big guy. Ain't happening. You also have no minions right now, so. Oh, he's just back going. Whose mans is this, dude? Hmm. 
I get the wave, I get the red buff. Do I pick up the red buff? Hmm. I want speed buff. I My ideal buff is speed. Also, if this guy was smart literally at all, he would just go do Boldy. Because I can't stop him. What, what am I going to do? Out secure a raw ult with my two? That ain't happening. But he's, he's just deciding to play like this because I think it's what he wants to do. It's the kind of play style he wants. Whatever, though. I think he's finally doing bull demon, dude. I don't hear him. He's not. Where the hell is he? He's doing his blue buff. Okay. Got a divine. There you go. Now I go pestilence. I also want to upgrade my curse donk. Ideally, I farm up to get upgraded Ankh and Tier 2 Pestilence. Dude, if this man didn't stand in his wave, I would literally never clear. He's literally letting Golden Blade hit him so I can pull the wave out of the heal. He's, like, he doesn't know it, but he's literally helping me clear the wave. If he just stood off to the side or some shit, I'd never clear a wave in my life. Toxic Blade? Oh, he's going Wing Blade. How much health do you have? Oh You're gonna have a little over 2k. Done with that Wing Blade. Um. Oh, you're here, huh? Fuck it. Let's try. Oh, he just sprinted away. I walked into that. Nice. Haha, <laughs> funny. He used both of his relics, so honestly, not a bad loss. Come here, you idiot. Almost. Healing back there with his minion wave. I still have enough mana for all of my abilities at least once, so. Alright, he missed his one, so we're safe. Okay, or he has a lot of cooldown and he gets his one back up before uh, 12 seconds goes by. He probably. Minions all get here at like. The 10 second mark I think like they'll show up here um so I think he does get it actually well maybe not because he's a mage huh but he does have tyrannical tyrannical minions kind of fucking slap yo I'm so slow holy Unfortunately, I can't do anything with that. And I need a hastened and I need upgraded Onk. I think hastened is way more important than upgraded Onk, though. If I can stick with him. What's up, minion? Drop his blue buff so he can't take that. All right. Nice and sharp. Now, Hastened will finish the build, and I should be able to just kind of beat him. He actually did go Toxic Blade instead of Wing Blade. That's so stupid. 
Alright, those are fire minions with a heal and tyrannical plate helm. I, how the fuck? I'm gonna lose my whole life trying to deal with one fucking wave. Got away, boy. Oh shit. That hit me though. He chasing me? Hmm. I'm so close. Alright, once his heal runs out. There's both of his relics. I literally can't fucking catch him. Oh my gosh. I'm dead here. No, I'm not. Mm, yeah, I am. No, I'm not. Your Titan's under attack. I have my hastened. Minions are coming up soon. Or not minions. Phoenix is coming up soon. I have my hastened. Now I just need to upgrade my Ankh. I'm getting blue by the way. I think cooldown's a big deal. He has no relics up. So this is the time to fight. I'm a little bit further away from that tower line, hopefully. Oh, he's just doing his blue. Okay. Gem of Iso right now. It's gonna be really annoying. All right, I'm gonna buy a 1500 speed pot because uh, I want to sell boots. If he's gonna go Gem of Iso like he did, then we're gonna have to go Wing Blade. Dude, I can't even keep up with him with... I mean, that was both of his... Ow. That was both of his relics, but... Suck a dick, idiot! Fat one, too. Not a normal-sized dick. Suck a big old dick. Go get a tower down. 
My Titan's healed back to full health, pretty much. I actually think maybe I, instead of Wingblade, I might go Kins. I might sell Wingblade for Kins. Wingblade is pretty good right now because of the fact that um, it will give me survivability, which I desperately need, but definitely not something that's long term. Power down. Dude, he could have just done Bull Demon like 12 minutes ago and won the game for free. Is he back dooring? Where the fuck is this guy? There he is. Wingblade sells for, I think, 1200. So, we need to farm 1500 to get a Kins. There's a lot of HP, right? 2140? Not a lot, but it's not a little. That raw. That one didn't hit me, would have been fine, but it did hit me, and now I lose the game, I think. Did I turn back into the one? Is that what happened? I thought it ended faster? I think that's exactly what happened. Yeah, I know. He probably wins the game right here, because he has minions coming in. Damn. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I mean, he didn't clear the wave. He honestly could have won if he just cleared the wave and let minions uh, push instead of him walking up and ulting it for no reason, then we'd be in a much worse spot. AKA, we wouldn't be in the game. He's like a, he's like a bot, dude. Like, you know how bots, when you're in custom games and you add a bot, how they'll just back up until they get to a wave and then wait and then push with the wave? He's like a bot. Because all he does is like AFK at waves. Oh, well, that's his two. Fuck a dick. Unfortunately, I don't even think I can get a Phoenix off of that. Because I push so slow against fire minions, but... Well, maybe I can. I'll have 10 seconds to punch a Phoenix in the mouth. And clear a fire minion wave, though. Eh. Obviously, we punch the Phoenix in the mouth first. Let me clear the back line. Let me clear the front line. Let me run like a...
He had a Doom Orb too. This man's like false scumbag. Backdoor and double defense, gem and full move speed. Grab this. Alright. That is not what I wanted. Alright, I have Phoenix spawning. Where is he? Is he just waiting to take my Phoenix again? No, he's just came back here. Okay. I want him to, once he uses his two, I all in him. But he's not bad. Two is what keeps him away from me though. Right, we run and then we blink on him now. Yo, this guy is... This guy is... I don't want to say bad, but like, god damn, he's bad, huh? Like, I think the only matches he wins, based on the way he plays, are matches against people who can't clear the, the wave early game. And then he just abuses that. With... Tyrannical and then movement speed. Holy shit. That was a 30 minute game. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you did enjoy the entire video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will... I want to see what if he says anything to me. Actually. No, oh, just GG. Alright. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And until next time, guys. Peace.